Hello guys, uh, today uh, I'm going to show you how to make uh, very simple portals uh, for your game. This concept can be used in 2D and I think it can be used in 3D. It uh, should work but then you will need to use different, uh, different uh, functions but uh, the concept is the same. So uh, we will start when we left off uh, in the previous tutorial so we have our scene the gates are blocking the way so I'll open them using uh, our liver system and here is another room uh, with four uh, four spaces the way is blocked by this wall so we need to make a portal for this so we can go over here and probably there could be some kind of exit leading to another room or uh, the end of the level or something like that okay mm. so we need to create uh, our portal first so let's do this uh, let's add new scene it will be 2d scene name it portal uh, add uh, sprite I'm going to use animated sprite because I've prepared very very simple egg and ugly uh, sprite sheet for this so I'll add some frames and I will create the animation from the, this uh, from that sprite sheet here it is open it has uh, three frames so let's select this add let's see how it works okay so this is rotating maybe I'll increase the speed it will do Mm, maybe I could add some particles effect I did this in my scaly game so add some particles this is not my favorite thing to making a process material for particles but I think I can do this <laughs> first of all I will set the gravity to zero so there's no gravity I need to increase initial velocity and I will increase the ve orbit velocity so my particles are spinning now let's change the emission shape to sphere and make it bigger and maybe I will increase increase the count the amount of my particles okay Maybe I will change the color for them. Okay, now let's add some light so the portal is glowing. Light 2D. For this we will need a texture. I will set the color. Blue. And I will increase energy a little bit okay so this is how uh, my portal will look like now I need to add area 2d so we can detect if player is touching is colliding with our portal and now I need collision shape with a shape it will be rectangle C 
so scale it a little bit okay we have a portal now we can save this and I'll add a script get rid of that uh, we will need to know uh, where this portal leads to so we need to know that its destination we will store this in this t destination variable in function ready we will set this to uh, destination will equal to will get node which don't exist now but it will be a child uh, it will be a child of uh, our portal so get node and now uh, we need to get global position global position uh, if we if we would if we would uh, use the get position or position it will it would get our uh, position inside uh, inside our portal so this uh, this won't work for us so we need to get global position and now we can add uh, a signal when player enters so on aria to the um, body entered function let's check if body name is equal to player because we because i want uh, that um, these portals uh, are can be used only by the player not by other uh, objects so I need that condition and if it is player then uh, I can set this body set position to destination and that's all for this as you can see it's very basic very simple uh, but now we'll need uh, another scene for our portal destination mm, maybe I'll add a sprite so we can actually see this in in the editor it's way too big for me so I will scale this 0.25 I scale this four times okay I change the color okay now we can save this and let's test if it if it's working so mm, Let's add our portal. Why can't I add this? Oh, it's portal GB. Uh, portal. Where is it? Okay, here it is. I'll move it here. Now let's add our portal destination. We are adding this as a child of our portal. So this will leave it here. We're adding this as a as a child because over here in the script uh, we stated that this will be the child of uh, uh, of our portal. So we'll have to do this like that. Now we can. Uh, copy this and move it 
so here will be another portal this one so destination will be over here let's copy this one move it over here it will lead here and now let's add the final one so this one leads to the beginning mm, yeah so this should work but I will make one change I'll add the script so when it's uh, when the portal destination is created is created in the scene I want to s uh, set it's so it's not visible for us you may leave it visible but I don't want that uh, so self visible equals false save and now I hope this will work so I'm over here I need to find a combination I succeeded okay so now if I remember correctly it was only one minute ago so I should so if I remember correctly uh, when I enter this portal it should uh, teleport me over here then from here it teleports me to here and from here to here and from here to the beginning so let's test this okay so I'm here now uh, top left yes over here and to the beginning that's all it's it's very simple it's I know it's basic but you can you can make very cool uh, levels with with this with with teleport uh, very cool mechanic mechanics uh, yeah so I hope you like it I hope uh, this will be useful uh, for you so yeah see you in the next one